Hey guys, Asian Mike here back with episode 47 of our Pokemon Sun Alola Log. On the last episode, we took on Possessed Lusamine, and we came out without anybody dying. And on the last episode, I asked you how many Pokemon do you think we're going to lose to Solgaleo today? So, without further ado, I'm going to switch to my Dark type, since this is a Psychic Steel type. And we are going to see... How this is gonna go. I wish I could lower his stats. Oh, please tell me you can eat this. Probably not. Well... <laughs> There's one! <laughs> I mean, I didn't expect him to survive, but... <laughs> yeah. I don't have any way of putting this guy to sleep. Please tell me you can live this. Okay. I don't know if that's a physical move or a special move. And I don't have any way of... Oh. Well, I don't need to hit you again. You're heavy. Nope. I mean, I'm not gonna attack you again. What it? Want a luxury ball, Solgaleo? Is that what it is? Come on, man. So wait, your move set is Sun Still Strike, Crunch, uh Cosmic Power. So we already lost our first mon, which is which is great.
Are you kidding me? What? Well, <laughs> I have to add him to the party. I mean, like, <laughs> it is said to live in another world. The intense light it radiates from the surface of its body can make the dark darkest of nights light up like midday. So, I think we shall name you Sebastian, as you bask in the light. Sebastian, you are the sun god. Let's see what we have to work with here. Oh, your nature is booty. Uh, whatever. Alright, well, sorry, Reginald. Sokaleo. No. Nebby. Nebby, you belong with Asian Mike now. He will be the one to raise you. Just like any parent should raise their child, he will be your father now. I may not have been able to do anything for you, Nebby, but I'm still glad I took you that day. So go with Asian Mike and see the world. Have battles against strong Pokemon where you can use your full power. Meet other trainers who will make your heart dance with the thrill of it all. That's the kind of world that Asian Mike can share with you. If it's you, Asian Mike, I know I can trust you to raise my Nebby well. Take good care of it. And I will go to my mother. I need to see for myself that she'll be alright. Nebby, don't always try be trying to get out of your Pokeball the way you always wriggle out of my bag. And, and don't forget that you're strong now. You have to be careful not to accidentally hurt anyone until you you get used to your strength. And and you can't just go running off to some other world anytime without telling anyone. You'll make Asian Mike worry. He's in a Pokeball, lady. Come on. Okay, I'm really... I'm really going this time. Alola! Cripes, but I hate this place. It's exhausting climbing all the way up here. At least you gave me a good show, though. Guess it was worth coming this far, and the professor did ask me and all. Look, once you've completed all your island trials and done your grand trial, then you've got to do one last thing. The final trial. Basically, it's a ceremony, you see. You beat all four kahunas in a row. But things are a little different this year. Now that we're getting a real Pokemon League here in Alola, too. So boy, I hope you can bother yourself to come along to the base of Ula Ula Island's Mount Lanakila. You remember Tapu Village, don't you, where the folks were doing construction work? He'll be ready and waiting for you there. I suppose I could take you along with me. You want to do that? Come now with me? Looks like we're going on this journey together then. Let me get some medication first before you start pulling me places, buddy. Oh, oh, no, 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 stop, stop. Persian wasn't even in the right spot. I gotta lay him to rest properly. And then I gotta teach some TMs to Solvaleo. 
Um, so if anyone's wondering why there's a Populeo in my uh, PC, in an Eevee, in a Ditto, it's because Arthur uh, wanted uh, his... Uh, why are all of you in the Abyss? Okay. Uh, Arthur wanted his own, um... I'm sorry, Reginald. Arthur wanted his own, uh... Firecat. So, I'm not gonna be using this Pocleo. Even though it's modest. So... We only have six lawns dead at this point of the LP. That's not too bad. So I'm gonna heal up, we're gonna get some potions, and then we'll be good to go. I mean, in retrospect, looking back, I probably didn't even need to go out into Reginald. I knew how garbage his stuff was, but... Oh, let me see what, uh, are you a special attacker or physical? Oh, you're a physical attacker. Okay. Then I guess this moveset's okay. Mm, who was the first leader, though? I can't remember. Oh, can I? I can purchase more items. Thank you. 300! Hello! Do I have anything to sell? See guys, you don't really need the Master Ball. I always think that's funny when people are just quick to be like, oh, I'm not risking it. Yeah, I lost a Mon out of it that I could have avoided, but... I mean... It makes the LP more fun, doesn't it? Like, I... Uh, at that point, I didn't know if, like, everyone was gonna die. <laughs> oh, that's another thing I need to buy, full heals. So now, we are all good to face the Elite Four. Probably not, but you know what? It is what it is. Oh wait, no. So they said the Kahunas are the Elite Four, so that means the first one's gonna be fighting, so I should lead with Roger. This is probably a horrible idea, but you know what? It's fine. Uh... I've been waiting for you. To thank you. For what you did for Lily. For our mother. I appreciate it maybe more than you know. The only thing I can offer you in thanks is a great battle. So I'm going to show my full power, my real full power this time with the Z-Ring that old man gave me. You came out of nowhere, buddy. And you're still doing these ghetto poses. Crobat!
Okay. Wait a minute, is that an ice or water type? If that's an ice type, I'm dead. It has to be water. Yeah, it has to be water. That was made specifically for your starter. I, I was worried there for a second. <laughs> I was like, there's no way this is an ice type. Like, what what purpose would that serve? You'd be weak to my starter. So Volley is actually surprisingly fast. I was watching, uh, I think it was... No, it was uh, Callum's video yesterday, and, uh, Savali outsped a Mega Salamance. I didn't even know that was possible. Ooh, Weavile. He has all the edgy Pokemon. That is how frail a Weavile is. He gets O-Code by a Flame Charge. <laughs> Lucar O. Yeah, I'm not gonna risk my starter like this. It's not worth it. Uh, yeah, it's not. I'm debating, but it's like, I've come this far with Lily, I don't want to risk him like that. Yeah, this probably would've killed. Glad Ian, I'd appreciate it if you stop. Yeah? Bye bye. Hm! <laughs> There's nothing more to say. You've got good Pokemon. I know what kind of trainer you are now, and what kind of journey you've been through. The man actually smiled. Lily wanted me to tell you something. She's looking after our mother at the foundation. She wanted me to tell you that you're the best Pokemon trainer in the world, Asian Mike. She gave this, gave me this, for you. That will be helpful. How's working hard to get stronger, too? Hmm. <laughs> If you two are going to get stronger, then I guess I can't let my guard down yet. I know we're, we aren't friends, but we aren't enemies anymore either. Keep winning. Maybe I'll see you again if you do. This guy... is... Hey, hey, look at Rotom, just, just ignoring that battle like it's nothing. Uh, that's, that's great. So yeah, what was it? It was, um, fighting, rock, 
uh, dark and brown. <clears throat> At least we kind of have a counter for Gastrodon this time. All right, guys. Well, I think that is a good enough point in the episode to wrap things up here. So, uh, question of the day. Will we make it through the Elite Four? Let me know in the comment section down below. Hit the like button if you can. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace.